Ryan. I'm very happy to uh, be here at the Metals Investors Forum, be able to give you an update on uh, what's going to be an extremely busy year for uh, Caliber uh, on our 100% owned ground and as well with our partners in uh, Nicaragua. We're very much a discovery story, so I invite you to visit our website and look at the uh, cautionary statements on our resource estimates there and as well the 43101 technical reports. So why invest in Caliber Mining? Obviously, there's a lot of good companies here. Uh, at this forum and, and uh, you know, what we think is, is going to put us ahead of, uh, of some of the others is, is again, a potentially transformative year for Caliber with uh, five drilling programs building on our existing resource of uh, 2.4 uh, million ounces. We're going to have three drill programs on our 100% owned ground and two drill programs that are fully funded by our partners, I Am Gold and, and Centera Gold. So these are, it's a very large uh, land position. It's, it's 900 square kilometers. That's 900,000 hectares. Uh, we continue to own 100% of about half of it and have optioned off uh, about 25% to Centera and 25% to uh, I Am Gold. As well, we've got a joint venture with uh, Rosita Mining. So uh, long history of mining in this district. Uh, Caliber, the company as well, has uh, got a, a strong management team that's had success in the industry. We've got five and a half million dollars in the bank and uh, we're going to have a different year. This is the uh, the management team. Uh, myself, I'm an exploration geologist, been working in Central and Latin America for the last 25 years. The company was put together by Doug Forster and, and Blaine Johnson and along with a number of the other senior management and, and directors have uh, just come from uh, a great success at, uh, at New Market Gold uh, and we're very excited now to have them uh, concentrating their efforts and focusing their time uh, on caliber. Uh, we've got 308 million uh, shares outstanding. Uh, again, 5.5, 5.4 million dollars in the bank, uh, fully diluted. We got another 10.2 million dollars. Got uh, fairly liquid stock. Uh, the last 60 days, you see over 300,000 shares a day. Actually, the last uh, few weeks in this uh, rally, it's probably closer to double that, 600,000 shares a day. Very significant shareholders, uh, B2 Gold, who's the largest gold producer in Nicaragua, is our, our largest uh, uh, shareholder at, at over 17% as well. Uh, Pierre Lassonde, obviously very well known in the industry, invested uh, over $3 million of his own money into the company, and uh, he currently sits at 12.2. Uh, and management has recently put in a, a $1.9 million of their own money as well to top up to almost 10%. Between those two, uh, three significant shareholders were about 40% of the uh, outstanding stock. You add in another three or four uh, significant shareholders and it actually gets well above half the float that's in, uh, in, in very strong hands. So uh, we're certainly aligned with shareholders. Uh, um, again, management is uh, going to be renewing their focus uh, uh, in terms of Doug and, and Blaine on this company and uh, we look for a really busy year. Very much a discovery story, and we've seen it, uh, obviously, including some, some very difficult times in our markets, but we've seen that our shareholders certainly do benefit from us uh, making discoveries in Nicaragua, uh, and we've made a number of those uh, over the last uh, half dozen years. Uh, uh, as well, again, to, to get through some of these tough times, we made the deal with uh, IM Gold. Uh, we, made, uh, we did the financing with Pierre Lassonde, and then as well, again, our partnership with uh, Centera. So we're very happy to have all of those three on as, as partners, and also very happy to still have 100% uh, of 413 square kilometers. This is very much a, a district uh, play. There's a number of different uh, styles of mineralization, and this is certainly one of the things that uh, Pierre Lassonde liked about the company is uh, potential for uh, large deposits in terms of uh, gold copper porphyries, which we found the first one in Nicaragua back in 2012, as well uh, high-grade deposits in terms of low sulfidation epithermals. These are the uh, type of deposits that B2 are mining in the country now, uh, and as well we've got resources there, and high-grade gold scarns. This is the largest deposit in this district historically is the La Luz gold scarn, which uh, we own past production of, of almost two and a half million ounces, uh, and as well we've got uh, almost a million ounces of resource uh, in the same type of mineralization. Nicaragua is a great jurisdiction. It's, it's been great for, for B2 and it's been great for us. We've been there since 2009. Uh, very supportive uh, government in, in, in terms of mining and, and foreign investment. Uh, gold mining is actually a very significant part of their economy. It's a top three export by value uh, each of the last half a dozen years. And uh, again, B2's uh, been able to develop and, and, and run their mines down there, export all of their gold, and uh, we, we certainly consider it one of the better mining jurisdictions uh, in the world. 
This is our very large uh, land uh, position, so again, almost 900 square kilometers. The color codes here, the yellow are 100% owned ground. The green on the, on the right-hand side in the east is the area we've optioned to. I am gold, the pink, we've optioned to Santerra, and then the red block in the middle is the joint venture we have with uh, Rosita Mining. The uh, red squares show the, uh, the various different uh, deposits that we've outlined that make up the 2.4 million ounces in gold resources, and the blue stars are the areas that we'll be drilling this year. Again, three projects on our 100% owned ground and two projects fully funded by our, our partners. First project we'll look at in detail is uh, the Primavera Gold Copper Porphyry. So this certainly is a, a project that has a potential to, uh, again, be very transformative for, for Caliber. So we, uh, we drilled this back in 2011 and 2012, actually just released the resource in uh, December of, of 2016, currently sits at 45 million tonnes for 1.2 million ounces uh, equivalent, about 65% of the value in gold and the remainder in, in copper. The image that you see there, all of the resources underneath that red dot and all of those other colours and, and stars represent additional targets that we have uh, within just a portion of this project area. That overall size of that anomaly is four and a half kilometres by five kilometres and we really have just tested the tip of the iceberg. Porphyry deposits in general tend to be very large deposits so we think this 45 million tonnes that we have is, uh, is just a start. The project where we've uh, first started drilling, so we started drilling here a couple of days ago. Again, this is 100% owned, it's the Monte Carmelo Goldsgarn. So this is the project where we've been uh, focusing our field efforts over the last couple of years, advanced this with auger drilling and the, the anomalies that you see there in terms of the color codes, obviously the hot colors are, are, are higher in, in gold grades. In particular, a, a series of auger holes that grade uh, almost five and a half grams over, over 105 meters. So we've got a 3,000 meter program that started this week on, uh, on this project and certainly we expect this will be generating some good news. Just uh, about a kilometer down the road from Monte Carmelo is Santa Maria. This is a different style of mineralization. This is low sulfidation epithermal, so similar in style to the two mines that B2 have in operation in Nicaragua. Uh, again, a very large project. Uh, it's a three kilometer long anomaly that you see there. Uh, good grades coming off on surface, uh, up to a couple ounces gold and over 100 grams per ton silver. Uh, and again, this project's never been drilled. So uh, we'll start here in about a month's time. You see a, an image there of the structures on surface as they've been exposed by some artisanal miners. So we know exactly where the structure is. We know how we're going to drill it. And, and uh, again, given the grades on surface, we expect to have some good success here. First partner we'll look at, this is the area we've optioned to uh, IM Gold, so it's 176 square kilometers, 176,000 hectares. We've got three drilling programs on this, a little over 18,000 meters over the last three years. We'll do another 7,000 meters with uh, IM Gold this year. And you see some of the results there, ranging in, in width between a, a meter and a half and up to almost 20 meters, and in grade between a, a couple of grams per ton with hundreds of grams per ton silver, uh, all the way up to about 100 grams. So this is a high-grade vein system. There's a number of targets here. We drilled about 25 targets. Uh, each year we'll be getting more focused, and the 7,000 meters this year will go into about five targets, uh, and we expect an updated resource estimate here by the end of the year. Our recent, most recent partner is Centera, so we signed a deal with them a little over a, a year ago. This is even a larger project, this is 253 square kilometers, historic uh, mining camp in the southern part there, which is the uh, host, the, the largest uh, historic mine in the district, the La Luz mine, which produced almost two and a half million ounces. That's where our largest resource uh, in this district is as well, at Cerro Aeropuerto. So those are two related deposits that uh, indeed are probably actually connected at, at, at depth. We had a very busy year last year. We, we did uh, regional work on the northern block and we're continuing that. We're gonna cover that entire block with sampling at wide spaces this year. Uh, we did some drilling in the resource area last year and we also did some drilling on some new targets that we developed. Uh, the highlights certainly being uh, an infill hole uh, with uh, on the edge of the resource that gave us over 50 meters of, of 10 grams. So again, real good potential for large deposits and, uh, and really good grades. So this is uh, certainly going to be a, a good year for, for, for Caliber. We, we've got off to a good start. We're drilling on 100% owned ground. We uh, started as well the drilling program for IM Gold. So we're going to have those five drilling programs. We're fully funded to get that done. We've maintained 100% ownership of about a half of this uh, district that we have here. Uh, and we're also really happy to have two good partners as IM Gold and Centera, who between them are going to invest over $3 million this year. 
Um, obviously, went through a lot of these slides fairly quickly. I'll be at the booth uh, after the panel's done. Uh, anybody has any questions on any of these uh, individual projects, I, I look forward to talking to you. Thank you.